Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Texas Model Home Tours with your host Alex Piak with Evolve Real Estate Group at EXP Realty. Today we're in Mustang Lakes, a community located in Salina, Texas. And we're at Tradition Homes and we're gonna be touring their 5531 model home. The home we're gonna look at today is a little over 3,400 square feet. It offers three bedrooms, three and a half bathrooms, three car garage, media room, home office. This is one of their patio style homes. I'm gonna explain what a patio style home is as we take our tour today. Now, make sure you hang out till the end. I'm gonna share with you some discounts, incentives that are currently being offered in Mustang Lakes and with Tradition Homes. Let's head inside and let's start our tour. All right, guys, hey, welcome inside the 5531 model home with Tradition Homes. This patio style home, and we're gonna talk a little bit about that, is one of the cooler one level floor plans that we've toured here on our Texas model home tours. Uh, we're gonna start here at the very front of the house is your first bedroom. Each bedroom does have a full ensuite with a full bath and walk-in closet. And these are very, very large bedrooms. Uh, this is easily a king or queen size bed with two large nightstands. And you can kind of get a gauge right here of how much open walking space you still have even with this dresser. So I'll show you the closets, bathrooms. And as we do that, let me tell you a little bit about what a patio home is. Uh, sometimes referred to as a zero lot line home. It basically means your yard is more of a smaller backyard with a side yard. And one side of the home is shared. And I'll go outside and I'll show you an example of that. Here we have a full stand-up shower. I like the two-tone with the black and white. Here's that bedroom, we'll head back in. Now, um, what you'll notice here is they got beautiful shiplap accent walls. Over here to the left, that's the showroom right now. Uh, that would be your three car garage entrance. We have our second of the three bedrooms up front. And again, this one, full ensuite with bath. We'll start over here. I'll show you again, another walk-in closet. So getting back to a patio style home, basically what that means, and actually, out this window will be a great representation where I can explain it to you. But again, another very good sized bedroom. So as you see right now out this window, that wrought iron fence, that fence line will be a neighbor's home, but that side of their home has no windows. So that's the zero lot line. So you kind of have a shared line, so to speak, but you still have full privacy because there are no windows on the one side that is shared. That's why it's called a zero lot line. With that being said, what makes this unique here in Mustang Lakes is their zero lot line, the lot sizes are 65 feet wide. Here's a great view, again, from the front of the house, the main entrance. This does have the first floor media room huge media room too this is a gorgeous size hopefully you guys are able to get a good feel for the overall size of this room but if you like to entertain game room media room this definitely fits the bill it's got your seven or nine point one surround sound built in you've got your double doors here French doors, those are solid core wood doors, so they're nice and heavy. And check this out, this is really what makes this house so stunning, is as soon as you walk in, look at these exposed beam cathedral ceilings. And then obviously we have a, just the open concept, huge kitchen, seating for eight at that dining area, and then it opens up to your living area. Let me, I'm gonna pan back around. I wanna show you the full view 
right from the front door so you can kind of get a feel of what that looks like. So with that glass front door, you're looking straight back in through here. Lots of natural light. I love how they built the kitchen around those two side lights as well. Let's take a look at that kitchen. And just absolute immense amount of countertop space. What's nice about what I'm showing you here, a lot of this is standard with the builder and the kitchen as far as the fixtures. We do have our gas cooktop. They've done a nice white painted brick. Backsplash. Carry the ship lap from the front right over here into our, exempt, our vent. So our exhaust vent there. We've got our double cabinet stack so it takes it all the way up. Nice accent lighting above. But then these windows just bring in lots and lots of natural light into the room. We've got beautiful quartz countertop. That's a door. So again, patio style. Let's actually go out here and then we'll come back to this room. We'll head out. So with the patio style home, you have these unique side courtyards. So you can see here, this is all finished. This will all be private even when the house next door gets built because they'll have no windows or visibility back here. So you've got this really nice usable side yard and this one here is fully finished. So this could be grass or as you can see, they've really finished this off. They've added all of this pavers. And then here's your back patio. So it's a full wrap around L-shaped patio. Perfect for anybody who wants to entertain. The patio style really is perfect for either that downsizer who doesn't want to maintain a ton of yard or somebody just getting started, maybe, you know, young, busy professional who doesn't have a bunch of time for yard work, but they want a nice size lot. Again, this is 65 feet by about 125, 135. So you're still getting a good size yard. So you can see over here where the fence goes right to the corner of the house. The next house would have their side yard on that side. So again, you keep a decent separation from the neighbor so you have some nice privacy. Here's a good view of the amount of covered space here in that patio. And you could build a cooking station out here. Obviously mount your TV out here if you want to entertain. A lot of people like to watch their sports hang out outside. We do have a lot of great weather for many, many months of the year here. Let me know what you guys think about that outdoor covered area, pretty special. And then here's our view again as we walk back in to our kitchen. Man, this kitchen is just beautiful. The two-tone with the stained island. Farm sink, ceramic farm sink. Let me know if you guys like that. That seems to be very popular right now, but the two-tone, really stunning. And that exposed beam, you've got your lights hanging right over the island. Beautiful. So if you like to entertain, this obviously opens up perfectly for those who entertain. You've got your dining area here. Look at all that cabinet space, incredible. Here's one of the coolest features. Check out this beautiful built-in hutch. Now you may, may be asking, where's the pantry? Check this out as we open up the double door, hidden pantry. Super cool. Lots of storage in here. What do you think about that hidden pantry? Let me know in the comments below. Close that up, give you another view from here. And I absolutely love that look, that kind of espresso colored exposed beam, cathedral ceiling. We'll head into the living area. Another large, large room here, so Oversized rooms, again, we're at 3,400 square feet on one level. So this is a big house, 
big usable room. Now keep in mind, this is only three bedrooms and an office. So 3,400 square feet gives you an idea. They kept large rooms. And here's a really cool office. One of the things I've noticed with Tradition is they're moving their offices and they're putting them in the back of the house versus the front. So I definitely want to hear your guys' feedback on that. Do you like this? Having that home office kind of tucked away in the back? Or do you prefer the front of the house? So if, you're, if you like to be kind of locked away, private, getting work done, no distractions, that really serves the purpose here. Where I know sometimes in the front of the house, right, you can look out the windows, you can see the neighbors, people walking their dogs, cars driving by. But this is nice and private and lots of natural light. Get all the windows in here. I could definitely see myself getting some work done in here. And we do have our double glass French doors that you can close off. Here's another view, get a good idea of the overall size of this living room. And then we've got our gas fireplace. We've got, you can see we've got 10 foot ceilings in this area here. All right, let's head into the primary suite, which is down this hallway. But before we do that, look at this laundry room. Yes, this is the standard size of the laundry room. Obviously you can add in the upper cabinets, the floating shelf, the sink area here, and then the built-in for additional storage. Definitely one of the nicer laundry rooms we've showcased here on the model home tours. Now this is a real primary suite, kind of doored off from the rest of the house. You enter this little foyer here. You've got your primary suite back. You've got two closets, so split closets, wardrobe closets to give you an idea. And these are good size, lots of hanging space. We've got three levels of rods, some built-in shelves. That's one, here's the other. Lots of built-ins. Okay, now, this is also really unique and cool. The bathroom is up front in the primary. A lot of times you're walking through your primary and there's a door to the bathroom, the primary bath, not in this, it's kind of located up front. Take a look at this. Beautiful finishes in here, large soaking tub. Here we've got beautiful oversized glass, seamless glass shower. Look at the size of that. Beautiful. So you can see that Tradition does a fantastic job with their finishes. They're not cutting any corners when it comes to quality. We've got our granite countertops in here. We've got our tradition homes. Very nice. We've got the herringbone design brick. So that is, looks like brick, tile, really cool. Come see this one in person, you will not be disappointed. It's got the nice light colored floors. Now let's take a look at the primary suite. Look at that. This is magnificent, it's huge. You've got your cathedral ceilings, tons of space, huge oversized windows with the bench area. Very, very nice. One of the cooler floor plans for sure. When we look at maximizing square footage, I think that's where they've really excelled here is we've got 3,400 square feet of all very, 
very usable square footage. It's square footage in the areas you want, your bedrooms, your entertaining areas, your kitchen, living area. None of these rooms are small by any means. Let's head back in here. Okay, we'll head towards the front door. I didn't really show you this. So this is kind of the path. You've got your media room over here. We've got just a half bath powder bath for any guests that are here. See, they've carried that brick. And I really do love looking at these staged homes. They just give you so many ideas that, you know, I think most people would be afraid to try or not sure how they look. That white brick look, the shiplap, even all that wood trim here in the media room. This is definitely a luxury product and there's many, many people that will fit the use of these patio style homes. Let's head back outside. Hey everybody, I hope you enjoyed today's home tour with Traditions Homes 5531 model. Make sure you leave a comment below. Let me know what did you like? What did you not like? What changes would you make? I thought it was probably one of the cooler homes that we've toured so far on our channel. And with a starting price in the low 800s, gives you a lot of options. Really enjoyed this one. Now, as promised, we told you about some incentives. There are some current incentives being offered, making new construction homes in Mustang Lakes even more affordable. So if you're interested in learning more, below the video is my contact information. Send me an email just asking for the incentive sheet for Mustang Lakes and Tradition Homes. We'll send you out the most current one, obviously. I don't know when you'll be watching this, so we wanna send you out the most current relevant discounts whenever you do see this video. But right now we are seeing closing cost credits, interest rate buy downs, and some discounts off of sticker pricing. So make sure you reach out. We're happy to get you that information. If you're thinking about buying a new construction home, we'd love to help you as well. Make sure you reach out. It will answer any questions about the home buying process, different neighborhoods, different builders, any questions you might have. I hope you enjoyed today's tour. We'll see you at the next model home tour. Take it easy guys.